The Northeast Development Commission has distributed about 120 operational vehicles to the police, the army, paramilitary and also ambulance and other medical equipment to the federal hospitals in the region. The managing director of the commission, Mohammed al Kali, presented the vehicles and hospital equipment to beneficiaries at the Multipurpose Hall Government House in Maiduguri. al Kali noted that the need to support the security and health sector in fighting insurgency in the Northeast is paramount as the region experienced insecurity over the decade, and he believed this contribution will go a long way to bring peace and stability in the Northeast region. to make a brief remark on the official handing over the relative of operational security vehicles to the Nigerian Armed Forces and other sister agencies, as well as ambulances and other medical equipment to federal medical institutions in the Northeast sub-region. Let me, on behalf of His Excellency and the good people of the state, appreciate and commend the efforts of the NDC for making this giant right. We hope that this support and many more peace, security and development efforts will continue to be rendered by the NEDC for the states in the region. Let me reiterate that the support being rendered to the security agencies will go a long way in enhancing their mobility and ability to respond swiftly to emerging security challenges. Assistance from any quarter of the Nigerian state, such as what the Northeast Development Commission has embarked on today is most welcome. Promotion of stability in relations between the military and the civil populace in the Northeast is part of the mandate of the Northeast Development Commission by demonstrating confidence in the armed forces and the other security outfits through providing multi-dimensional support to their efforts in addition to the Commission's collaboration with the Office of the National Security Advisor in delivering the DDRR Action Plan the Northeast Development Commission is my honor and privilege to welcome our distinguished August visitors to Borno State to witness the handing over of vehicles to security operatives as well as medical equipment to the state. Let me specifically welcome with appreciation the Honorable Minister of Humanitarian and Services for the tireless efforts towards mitigating our humanitarian as well as security challenges in the state. I'm also calling the Nigerian military that we shall do everything possible to reduce the incessant attack. The most important thing that I shall be calling upon the Nigerian military is for them to create enabling the environment for our farmers to go back to their land. We shall be determined enough to chase them out from our land. 